Hello friends, in engineering drawing subject, we are going to learn orthographic projections in which today we will learn how to draw an orthographic view using first angle projection method. So here it is our data for the problem. Draw orthographic views of an object, front view, top view and left hand side view using first angle projection method. To solve this problem, let us see the different views of this 3D object. Now, draw a vertical line and horizontal line. Name the horizontal line by point XX and vertical line by point YY and name the intersecting point by point O. With the help of roller scale, draw a line parallel to line XX above and below at a distance of 10 mm. Similarly, draw a line parallel to line YY ahead and behind at a distance of 10 mm as shown. You can keep any distance as per your requirement. Now, mark the points in each quadrant as shown. These are the reference points for drawing the views in each quadrant. Here, as per the given data, we have to draw a front view, top view and left hand side view using first angle projection method. As we know, in the case of first angle projection method, we have to draw a front view in the first quadrant and top view below the front view and left hand side view right hand side of the front view. So we will consider this is our first quadrant, this is second quadrant, this is third quadrant and this is fourth quadrant and we will draw a front view according to this so that there will be space for the top view as well as left hand side view. Here, the reference point is located at bottom right corner. So let us observe the front view of a given object with respect to given direction of view. So as we can see that this is our bottom right corner in the front view. So that point will be our starting point for drawing a front view. Now, as per the given dimension, from the reference point, draw a horizontal line of 50 mm, draw a vertical line of 40 mm, draw a horizontal line of 50 mm, draw a vertical line of 40 mm. Now, from this point, mark a point 8 mm above, and from that point, draw a horizontal line of 40 mm and draw a vertical line of 32 mm. Now, from this point, mark a point 20 mm above and from that point, draw a horizontal line of 40 mm. Now, our front view is completed. Now, let me show you the dimension of this front view so that you can draw it easily. Also, name the view which is front view. Now, to draw a top view, take the projections of each point of front view in the downward direction as shown. Now, let us observe the top view of given object with respect to direction of view. So, top right corner will be our starting point for drawing a top view. From that point, draw a horizontal line of 50 mm, draw a vertical line of 40 mm, draw a horizontal line of 50 mm, draw a vertical line of 40 mm. 
now from this point mark a point 15 mm below and from that point draw a horizontal line of 40 mm and draw a vertical line of 25 mm from this point mark a point 10 mm above and from that point draw a horizontal line of 40 mm now let me show you the dimensions of the top view so that you can draw it easily also mention the name of the view which is top view as per the first angle projection method we have to draw a left hand side view at a right side of the front view to draw a left hand side view we have to transfer the projections of top view for that with the help of protractor from point o draw a line of any length at an angle of 45 degree let us observe the left hand side view of given object with respect to direction of view draw a projections of each point from top view up to 45 degree line and transfer it in upward direction now draw a projections of each point from the front view here bottom left hand side corner point will be our reference point for drawing a left hand side view from the reference point draw a horizontal line of 40 mm draw a vertical line of 40 mm draw a horizontal line of 40 mm draw a vertical line of 40 mm from this point mark a point 8 mm above and from that point draw a horizontal line of 10 mm draw a vertical line of 12 mm draw a horizontal line of 15 mm draw a vertical line of 20 mm let me show you the dimensions of left hand side view so that you can draw it easily also mention the name of the view which is left hand side view now mention the dimensions as per the dimensioning rule i hope you understood it if you have any questions let me know in the comment box thank you